to my opinion, doing them every night is gonna be ideal, especially if hair growth is the goal. Welcome to another Curly Chemistry video. I'm so glad you are here. Today, we are going to do a deep dive into length retention and scalp health strategies for low porosity hair. And if you don't know what porosity you are, still stick around because you're going to find some great valuable information in this video, okay? You guys know I don't waste any time. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so first of all, let's do a little introduction on low porosity hair for those who may not know. This is when you have a tightly bound cuticle that has a hard time receiving moisture. And a lot of times, a few telltale signs is that your hair takes a very long time to air dry. Or if you spray water on your cuticle or your hair, you see little beads of water kind of just piling up on the cuticle, which is typically a sign of low porosity hair among other other tests as well okay now the issue with this is because the cuticle has a hard time receiving moisture um, it tends to receive buildup quite often and of course it can lead to dryness and then ultimately breakage so that's kind of like the challenge of low porosity hair now the first strategy I'm going to recommend for anyone who has a hard time with receiving moisture into their hair or you have low porosity hair is utilizing heat Heat is going to be the key, the gateway to length retention and of course seeing the growth that your scalp is giving you. So when I say using heat, I want you guys to start incorporating using a steamer or a heat cap or even getting under a dryer when you are doing your deep conditioning treatments. I kind of cheat a little bit, I ain't gonna lie, in the shower, like if I'm doing a deep conditioner, I'll just put a shower cap on in the shower and let the steam in the shower do the deep treatment for me okay but some level of steam and heat is going to help your hair absorb that moisture ultimately leading to less breakage less dryness and more length retention and i mentioned earlier how because of the cuticles are so tightly bound that can alone lead to product buildup so if you're using like a lot of heavy products a lot of butters because the cuticles are so tight in the way that they are that product is really going to start to accumulate on the hair and sometimes you can physically see it like actual like a layer of product just sitting on the hair itself so opting for lightweight products gel cream products are going to be golden for you because with gel cream products these formulas tend to have more water within them so you're getting that hydration but it does have a little bit of oils and butters to help with that softening of the cuticle and also locking in that moisture as well and our hair low porosity hair i should say absorbs gel creams a lot better than heavier creams so if you're looking for some recommendations of course i'll have my amazon store below you guys check it out but definitely lightweight products gel cream products always seal with a light to medium oil that can be sweet almond that can be avocado that can be grapeseed just to help to lock in that moisture as well and you guys already know that scalp care is the foundation to healthy hair and having a clear healthy scalp is going to be substantial when it comes to hair growth and just once again growing healthy hair so doing clarifying shampoos once a month will be ideal because once again with low porosity hair we tend to have that product build up and sometimes product even sitting on our scalp for long periods of time so doing a clarifying shampoo will be ideal for kind of giving your hair and your scalp a good reset and getting rid of all that product buildup. Because clarifying shampoos can be a little drying sometimes, always follow with a good deep conditioner after you clarify your hair to bring that moisture back into your hair. And of course, you guys already know, keep up with your moisture cycle. That's gonna help tremendously with reducing breakage. Your moisture cycle could be every two days. Moisturize and seal your hair. That's gonna be key. And then of course, scalp massages are gonna be ideal, especially after you get that product buildup off of your scalp. That is a great time to do a good scalp massage. In my opinion, doing them every night is going to be ideal especially if hair growth is the goal so i know that was a lot of information hopefully it wasn't too much information but definitely those are the length retention strategies and the scalp care strategies i recommend for low porosity hair your hair is literally in need of moisture it's just finding the different techniques to get that moisture into it and that's where lightweight gel creams come into play adding that heat when you're deep conditioning your hair, keeping up with exfoliating your scalp, clarifying shampoos and your moisture cycle and scalp massage will go so, so far, okay? okay. All right, curl friends, hope you've enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please be sure to like this video and to stay in the loop for more curly chemistry content, hit that follow button or the subscribe button to stay in the loop for more curly chemistry content. And of course, I have a question for you. 
When it comes to your current hair care journey, your regimen, I want you to comment below and share one thing that is working for you. And it can be the biggest thing or it can be the littlest thing, but what's the one thing that you are finding that is actually working for your hair or your scalp? Whatever, it can be anything, okay? Comment below, let us all know, and I cannot wait to see your responses. And if you wanna learn more about your hair from a cosmetic chemist perspective, check out all of the Curly Chemistry eBooks, the resources, all of the things. It is literally all the information you need to know regarding the chemistry and the biology of your hair, especially when it comes to ingredients, science. So check out all the Curly Chemistry eBooks for my hydrating herbal hair tea rinse. Yes, it is still in stock. Yes, we are still doing free shipping. It's a great way to enhance the slip of any conditioner on your wash day, shorten your wash day time, and also help to reduce shedding and support hair growth okay so definitely check it out i'll put the link below for you if you're interested in signing up for one-on-one -on -one hair care coaching my calendar is open okay so the link is below for more information if you want to connect one-on-one -on -one about your hair or your scalp and it's via a uh, video so we will connect via zoom where i can actually see your hair and your scalp and if you're interested in starting a hair care line i would love to connect with you as well to bring your idea to fruition all right i love you guys so much i'll talk to you guys soon